This is part two of the March break update. Okay, well, getting back to what I was saying there, um, uh, today we went to the dentist and Chris was so surprised. Um, Julia did very well. Um, Brian went to the washroom and I just heard her barely say, um, I want my dad, I want my daddy. So um, the hygienist that was cleaning her teeth coached her through it, and then she was great. They were um, really impressed, especially Susan, the receptionist. She was impressed, too, and said that today was Julia's best visit ever. So we go back in six months. <clears throat> I'm getting tongue twisted here with my words. We go back in six months, which brings us to September. So I might have to work around it depending on Brian's schedule, um, <clears throat> but um, I think how it's going to work is Brian's just going to take the day off because Julia is going to be in school full time. So I want to try to get an appointment um, after school if possible, or possibly anything um, after two thirty-three. This way she can still go to school and be there for most of the day and just miss the tail end of it, which should be okay. So, um, like I mentioned, um, Julia did well, no cavities, because she still has all her baby teeth and none of them have fallen out yet. Um, Brian, uh, well, Julia was supposed to go first, but she was in the washroom, so they took Brian in. And then Julia came back and she said, oh, this was a long time to wait. But I said, well, you were in the washroom, so they took Daddy. So Daddy went in and Brian came out and said, um, I had to ask him how things went. And he said, just one of my feelings is chipped, so I got to come back. So um, then it was Julia's turn and then my turn. <clears throat> And we did really well. So I'm just going to keep up what I'm doing. And uh, things should be okay. So after that, we um, Brian had already made the appointment for himself to come back. And our six-month appointment. And then all I had to do was find out the balance after it went through the insurance company. And then I paid. Um, it was $5 less than what I was expecting to pay. So then we went to Tim Hortons for lunch. Um, me and Julia had really had to go to the bathroom, so we went to the bathroom and then we had our lunch. And the weather was so beautiful. Um, I wanted to walk to the park because Brian had some time, because I had noticed we had missed the bus. But you know, Brian, he wanted to wait for the next one, so we waited for the next one and uh, got off and walked up a little bit and went to the park for a bit and then after the park we walked Brian to the bus waited for his bus and then after that Julia and I decided we were going to walk to 7-Eleven so after we walked to 7-Eleven we took a little walk and we um, found a bench near um, the YMCA um, the tennis courts so we sat on one of the benches that were there nobody was playing tennis but we had a nice uh, sit and enjoyed our treats that we had and uh, from there we walked up to the bus and then when we got home I was going to start dinner and then start putting away the laundry but I ended up getting into my soaps and we have digital cables so there's time shifting so if I miss my soaps um, I can catch them from three to five if I miss them one to three. So I did that and then um, just as I was uh, going to go upstairs with the laundry, my sister calls. She says, what are you doing? She says, this is not much. She says, just our dinner. I says, no. She says, I, want f I feel like going out for dinner. I want to go to Arby's. I'm like, okay, sure. So um, I told her, um, if you ever want to order in or go out, um, just call me before four and then you know, we'll do whatever you want to do. Because usually around four and after, I start dinner. So, um, oh, my nose is itchy. 
So what I was going to make tonight, um, we're going to have tomorrow, we're going to have uh, boiled potatoes, potato, potatoes, uh, vegetables, and shake and bake pork chops. So that'll be good. And I usually like my pork chops with some applesauce. So um, my sister got home. I was able to wrap a gift, two gifts for two special people. Um, and got that done, put the laundry away. My sister showered after we chatted for a bit. Um, I did a few little um, res like responding back to uh, some people. And um, then when my sister was ready, we left and we went. We brought some food back for the boys. Um, hold on one sec. My nose was itchy there. So, now I'm just um, going to try to catch up on some videos here and respond back. Um, and just wait for Brian to get home. He should be home soon. And uh, gotta let him know I got a package. Um, I gotta get out tomorrow for two special people. Um, one particular person um, who I have a gift for, I could have sent it earlier, but um, I knew someone, um, a special day was coming up. So rather than making two deliveries, I'm just gonna make one. So then they'll get each their gifts. So anyways, um, I'm going to go now, get caught up on videos, and um, we'll talk to you soon.